There once was a Japanese soldier who for 29 years continued to fight World War II on a small Pacific island because he had never heard that the war was over. Rescue parties were sent to search for him, but he hid because he thought they were enemy scouts. Leaflets were dropped, newspapers were dropped, photographs and letters from his family and relatives were dropped, all saying that the war was over and that he didn't have to fight anymore. But believing it to be enemy propaganda, he continued to live as if the war was ongoing. Finally, in 1974, a young man went on a mission to find this legendary soldier. He succeeded where so many others had failed. This long lost Japanese soldier, now in his 50s, personally read the orders from his commanding officer that the war was over and had been for nearly three decades. The soldier's words were, what have I been doing all these years? 2,000 years ago, a man went on a mission to rescue you and me. He came to die in our place and to share good news with the whole world that the war is over. He has already won. And if we'll believe on his name, he will give us freedom. Freedom from bondage, sin, addiction, and fear. And the freedom to live lives of victory, truth, love, service, and forgiveness. The question is, will we believe and embrace the good news of freedom? Or will we continue to live our lives as if we're still in the war?